Welcome to your introduction to the patient document management system. PDM will become available for all St. Joseph's clinicians in October 2015 and will be used to complete deficient health records and view historical medical records of all patients discharged after September 1, 2015. PDM provides easy access to patient medical records that will allow clinicians having all the necessary patient health information at their fingertips. With PDM implementation, clinicians will get 24-7 online intuitive access to the patient records with no need to wait for data. PDM allows access to a patient chart by multiple users at the same time and eliminate the need to move physical charts between areas. This will ensure continuity of patient care among different healthcare providers. PDM provides a single repository for all health records documents and can be accessed through different systems such as provider portal, patient link, and clinical connect. This is the illustration of how patient health information will flow in the PDM. All the information generated by the clinical application we use here in St. Joseph's will be getting into PDM in the electronic format. All the information from the paper chart will be scanned into PDM. As the result, we will have one consolidated patient health record in electronic format accessible for multiple users through PDM application. Now let's have a look at the application itself. After launching application, the PDM homepage is the very first screen that appears once you log on. There are two main areas here that allows users to review historical patient information and complete deficiencies assigned to them by health record department. There is an additional feature that allows users to send messages to each other within the application. There are several ways to search for a patient. Basic search allows you to search for patient charts based on basic patient information, such as care site, account number, medical record number, patient name, health card number, and date of birth. My patient search allows clinicians to search for their patient charts, and clinicians can also specify additional criteria, such as care site, affiliated user, visit type, and date of a document arrival. So let's search for a patient. You can choose the patient from the patients list. This particular patient has two different charts for two different visits. Once a chart is selected, within a chart you will see a list of patient documents on the different tabs, similar to a paper chart. The names, the colors, and the order of tabs are predefined and used consistently across all patient charts in St. Joseph's. You can select any document. The selected document displays in the document viewer area. On the right-hand side, you have a toolbar. You are able to scroll through the documents, rotate them if you need it, zoom in and zoom out. You are also able to add a bookmark to the selected document for a future review. Now let's talk about the chart completion. PDM chart completion functionality is the other reason why our clinicians will be benefiting from PDM solution. There is no more reason to go and physically retrieve the health record to complete deficiencies assigned by health record department. With an easy access to the patient chart and a simple procedure of completing the deficiencies, clinicians will always be compliant with the patient record documentation and completion policy and better support hospital funding requirements. Physicians will be able to complete deficiencies within PDM application at their convenience, where and when it better fits to their schedule and the lifestyle. And it doesn't take that much time now as it used to be. 
on the home page under the chart completion section, you will see the list of deficiencies assigned to you. Select the checkbox for the deficiency type you want to work with. Retrieve deficiency. That brings you directly to the document that needs to be addressed. So here is the signature deficiency. To sign the document, you need to click on the signature box and the document is signed. On the home screen under the chart completion section, you will see that you have no signature deficiencies anymore. Now you can work with other deficiencies you have. Let's select dictations, retrieve it. It brings you to the document that have to be dictated. You can review the chart, dictate the document, and enter the job ID, and click the button dictated. If you check your deficiency list, you will see that there is no dictations left. So the last deficiency we have is update deficiency. Let's address it. Retrieve the deficiency. To update the document, click on the edit button. Update the document. Click on the edit button. Save the document. Place your signature, click on sign, and click on complete button. To check the list of your deficiencies, go to the home screen and under the chart completion we see that there is no outstanding deficiencies anymore. Now we may leave the application. Remember to log out at the end of your session.